All right, yeah, it was a really big weekend for the Bison uh, soccer team. Uh, we went in Friday night knowing we didn't control our own destiny, but got some good news right before kickoff that uh, South Dakota had beaten Western Illinois. So we knew with a win on Friday night we'd get into the tournament. Uh, beat Fort Wayne 3-1 to one on Friday night. It was a great effort by our team. Uh, two goals from our freshman, Lauren Miller, who's again was named Conference Player of the Week for the third time today. Uh, and a senior, Steph Jacobson, scored the winning goal on senior night, which was really huge for us. So it was a good win, and now we head off to uh, Fort Wayne for the uh, Summit League tournament. Uh, we face South Dakota State. It was a great team. Uh, we played them two weeks ago, lost one nothing down in Brookings. And, uh, you know, it should be a really competitive game. They're very athletic. They're very fast. It's a team that, give, you know, really gives us fits with their, with their speed up front. Uh, but it should be a really competitive game. Again, it was one nothing down at their place. So uh, we're excited to head off to Fort Wayne and hopefully, you know, beat South Dakota State on, uh, on Friday night and then see who we get in the final. And, you know, Denver right now is 13 in the country. They're probably the favorite to win. But we're hoping we go out and give them, a, you know, give a good run and get a result, two results this weekend. Any questions? Lauren's had a tremendous year. She's had uh, nine goals, seven assists. I think she's the uh, either second or third leading scorer in the conference right now. Uh, we knew coming in she was a big time player, and uh, she's really proved it. Certainly in the Summit League, she's had uh, you know th three times Player of the Week, uh, multiple goal games several times for us, uh, two overtime game winners, and uh, really proving that she's you know a top ranked player in the country and, and has played tr tremendous for us. How much for yourself the experience of last year going to the conference tournament? Can you help with this young team? to say, you know, it's one and done here, we have, to have our best game on Friday. Yeah, I think we, you know, we've been kind of one and done for a couple of weeks now. You know, we've known we've had to win some games, and and with you know with a young team, you just got to kind of you know bring them along. We've asked the seniors and the upperclassmen to kind of be the leaders, and, and our three seniors have done a great job. But you know, this is my second time in the Summit League tournament. We lost in overtime last year. We know the pressure, and uh, we know the team that we're playing is very hungry, and so are we. So it's just a matter of staying focused and being consistent. And that's what we've been a much more later in the season for us. It's been a much more consistent team and a hardworking team, and that's what we're going to try to do on Friday night. You know, in, in soccer, any, you know, on any given day, you can beat anybody. Denver has been the number one seed the last two years in their conference tournament and lost both games in penalty kicks, so they're beatable. Uh, you know, they're, they're already in the NCAA tournament. They're going to get an at-large bid. Uh, but what we did out there is we defended really well, and unfortunately we went in a little bit nervous and scared and gave up two goals in the first ten minutes. But once we settled in and we scored against them, we kind of started to believe that we can play with them. And I think the big key right now is our kids believe we can play with them. You know, we defend very well. We get numbers behind the ball, which a lot of teams in our league I don't think have done. They've tried to go out and attack them. We went out and defended them and looked to counterattack, and I think that's something we'll look to do on Sunday if we get a chance at them. But uh, it's certainly a team that we're, I don't think we're scared of anymore, and we're going to give it our best when we get if we, if we get a chance with them on Sunday. All right, thanks, guys.